Let's go, Gravity Comet, man. Yo, this guy getting, like, crushed. What's up, guys? It's Celeviathan, and we are back with another reaction. Today, we are continuing Eden Zero Episode 11. And, man, oh, man, was Episode 10 interesting. Um, It, it started off kind of, like, uh, basic, but then... That was probably one of the greatest cliffhangers so far in this show. That had me kind of going like speechless for like a minute. <laughs> anyway, uh, quick recap: Shiki, um, Homura, went and uh, Wise went to go work rescue, uh, whatever, rescue Rebecca on uh, Gilst uh, from that Ilega guy. Um, weird thing is, we meet the sister, the other member of the crew who is a part of the Eden Zero, along with Ziggy in the past. Um, the witch, I finally remembered her name, Miss Witch. <laughs> she said that it's, um, it looks different. It's not the sister, but it's the same, like, identification number. So it's like, it still has her QR, like, her serial number, but it's not actually, it's, it's a little bit confusing, and I, and I hope we clear that up in this episode. But whatever. Anyway, we go through the episode. We learn what Homura's uh, ether gear is. It's Soul Sword. Um, we find out that Wise is more useful than he appears to be with um, his ether gear. <laughs> Honestly, I thought his ether gear was kind of useless. But upgrading stuff and upgrading machinery and stuff. Yo, in a world a futuristic like this, that's a pretty useful ether gear. I'm not even gonna lie. Um, what else happened? We got see to see Ilega get his um, ass beaten. And um, establish a fight, fight with Shiki and uh, the other robot named Jin. So we'll have to see what happens with that. Um, I'm excited to see what that fight though. It looks like it's going to be pretty good. His um, wind ether gear is interesting. And he's not really even um, like completely a robot. He's also a cyborg. So he has like human parts within him. So I want to know what's up with that. Um, anyway, we're just going to get started with this episode. Just going to jump right into it. Oh wait, I forgot. You think I was gonna forget? No, the damn chronophage. That was like, like eating planets like they were nothing, like one by one. Like, how how do you just go through life like that in like pure destruction, like, <laughs> and just be so casual about it? The witch lady was like, "Yo, planets are dying one by one, like it was nothing." A chronophage is coming, not the chronophage. A chronophage. So there's multiple, uh, like multiple beasts like these crazy anyway we're really gonna get started now don't forget to like share and subscribe turn on notifications so you know when i upload next for reactions like such as eden zero and many many more don't forget to check out that patreon link down below for this show uncut reactions of this movies anime whole bunch of other stuff check out the patreon it's definitely worth it. <laughs> anyway, without further ado, we're gonna get started with Eden Zero Episode 11. Let's go. Bro, yo, that thing is gonna like eat up Gilst, man. Yo, anybody who like is eaten that it, like that doesn't belong on the island or doesn't belong on sorry not island planet will get erased let's say two hours gets taken away you you disappear and you don't exist <laughs> that's crazy well that was worth the eight year boat ride that's crazy to think about man <laughs> Let's go, Gravity Comet, man. Yo, this guy getting like crushed. なんだこのガキは。おや、教会で会った子羊ではないか。なるほど。私をつけてきたのか。
one robot man besides sister man yo i do not like that guy man at all Yo, they're gonna kill Iliga, and they're gonna rob Iliga, yo, let's go. I don't even care, like, like, I want that to happen to this guy. <laughs> yo. Really the sister, though? Or do you think, like, somebody messed with her, like, uh... I don't know. Maybe with her like programming or something? あれ、コバちゃんはコバちゃんがいないわ。どっかで外れちゃったの?そんな。どうしよう。探さないと。私が北道戻って探してくる。生存率を上げるためには外れた人員の捜索自体が非効率的だと言ってるのです。それでも友
<laughs> yeah, that's the that's the real sister Ivory right there, man. Yo, she just stole her whole identity and hooked her up to a machine for 10 years. That she was taking her powers. Oh my god. You're an imposter. That's <laughs> an imposter. That man is the imposter. There can't be two Spider-Men. Let's take them both in. Bro. Yo, just stop the cat, man. Like, don't act like you were trying to, trying to do, like, the helpful thing, man. You literally tried to make money right now. You literally tried to kill a guy and rob him. <laughs> yo, yo, never mind, man. Yo, never mind. Sister Ivory's a badass, yo. She's kicking her ass, yo. <笑>あれが本物の Bro, yo, her witch is hooked up to her mind. She's like, yo, sister, what's up? Yo, witch, it's been a minute. How you doing? <laughs> Jeez, like, Louise. The job is on here. Right. Oh. Oh, maybe he came here. Maybe she came here to stop Ilega. Maybe that's what her whole, like, like deal was. She saved them. Yo, Jin is like, yo, I want Shiki's blood right now, yo. I ain't leaving here until we fight. Yo, Jin is pissed, bro. Bro, they saved all the girls, man. Yo, this is this is a big W right here. They saved everybody, yo. Any Lega got killed too. Yo, it's here. Yo, Chronophage looks kind of crazy. I'm not even gonna lie. It looks like a crazy time black shadow dragon. But yo, I'm loving the sister. She she is she's a great character. Yo, Chronophage is here, man. <laughs> yo, another great, great freaking episode. Um Where to start? Like like these episodes there's just always so much going on that it's kinda hard to like really grasp what part I liked. Okay. So we got that fight with Jin and Shiki going on. Rebecca got some revenge on Elega, which was cool. And we got to see why she's such a good little uh, sniper, I guess. She got a nice shot, yo. She, 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 she the sniper of the crew, man. She the sniper of the crew. <laughs> I'm comparing this a lot with One Piece, but it's giving me a lot of One Piece-esque type of vibes, but in a faster type of recruiting type of thing. But, okay, we got through that. We got to see Jin and his, like... He's pissed. There, there's something going on. He has a deeper story, I can tell. He seems like more of a main character than... Or more of a character than the other two did. Because of how quickly they kind of just got 
destroyed and whatnot. So, and he's kind of a cyborg, so he's half human. He's not just um, a robot like everybody else, right? Or a bot. Um, sister was a fake, of course we knew that, and literally was just pathetically destroyed by the real sister Avery, Ivory. And Sister Ivory, yo, dude, I love her character. She is actually great, to, enjoyable to watch. I'm not even gonna lie. Um, I didn't expect that. Because when you look at her face, she looks like she's serious or something. Like she'd be a serious character. But she ain't. She, she, she a badass. And she's the healer of the crew. <laughs> so I can't wait to see the other, uh, the rest of the Eden Zero crew. The next two that they have to recruit, um, you got Witch, we got Sister, I don't know what the other two are called. Oop, that just fell out, whatever. I don't know what the other two are called. Um, but, uh, <laughs> it was crazy. Uh, what else happened? Um, oh, the Chronophage, of course, that's like the highlight of the ending right there. Um, Chronophage is, has arrived, it's ready to, uh, eat up everything. And gonna take some time up, so I don't know what's gonna happen going forward. Um, we might see what the Chronophage. I don't think anybody's really gonna die. I think they're gonna escape, and we're gonna see the Chronophage actually taking time from a planet, which I'm really excited to see. I hope it's uh, a lot of uh, like. I hope it looks good. You know what I mean? <laughs> I assume it will, but whatever. Um, and I think that's it for the recap. Um, I don't think there was anything else that really stood out with the episode except that, um, and and of course Alega's uh, just desserts, which is which is really great, and the fact that Sister saved all those other women, which was awesome. Um, I just knew that they weren't gonna let them die, you know. Part of me was like, this is a fairy tale. They're gonna die. This is gonna be a a a, a very like dark anime type of thing. This ain't gonna be like, no, they didn't let them die. None of them died. All of them lived. So happy ending there, but. It's okay, like, you don't need to die to have tension, you know? There was enough tension in that plotline to, to really make it seem like they really were going to die. Like, I didn't expect Sister to save them. You know what I mean? I, I, I couldn't have predicted any of that. But anyway, um, that's it. Yeah, that's really it for the video now. I'll see you guys around. Hope you guys have a great day. And, um, out. Peace.